What is going on guys, it is your boy MLG Squid here and welcome back to another video guys and I'm doing one on Infinite Warfare. Now I've been playing this game a lot in the past couple days and I've been having so much fun with it. I just unlocked the Raijin EMX or the Raijin EMX, I call it the Raijin. Um, it's, it's, it's a pretty good weapon, honestly. You gotta have skill to use it, definitely, unlike the VPR. But, um, I was using the R3K to do my challenge, I completed the entire challenge. And then I got, um, from a comment slide up. I got uh, the Atlas smoke screen, which I, w I really like the Atlas. I was using it a little bit, and I, I it's a, it's definitely a pretty good weapon. But that's not what we need to talk about today, guys. We're going to be talking about DLC 4 for Infinite Warfare. Now, Infinite Warfare, guys, I haven't bought any of the DLC in. I've only played multiplayer mostly. I'm only a level 77 in Zombies, which, you know, some people might say that's good, but... Not really compared to 444 and BO3, considering I've had IW for almost triple as long as BO3. Three times as long as BO3. So, basically, guys, there's been a lot of rumors. Um, well, let me just start off with saying that Infinite Warfare DLC 4 has the hype is almost non existent anymore. It used to be a lot. A lot of people actually used to care about DLC 4. When DLC 3, when all the, like, the, uh, the things were found in the map, and, you know, radioactive thing, a lot of people, um, thought that Extinction was gonna be coming back, which I don't think Extinction's gonna be coming back. I'm almost, I'm 100% positive it's just gonna be zombies and not Extinction. Of course, we'll have bosses like Extinction, I'm almost 90% sure of that, but it's not gonna be, like, with a drill or anything. I'm positive. 100%, 110% positive it's not going to be like that. They're not doing that, guys. If they do, then I'm del I'm going to delete my channel. <laughs> nah, I'm seriously not going to ever do that. But, guys, basically, um, the hype around DLC 4 has gone away because, you know, World War II beta is going on right now. And, uh, it's, it, World War II is right around the corner. Um, I guess Black Ops 3 is getting updates still, which I don't really care about Black Ops 3. But, you know, I still play it, I guess. Uh, I, I don't enjoy playing it, but I still play it, I guess. But, um, not very many people care about Infinite Warfare anymore. They're like, they, the game used to have some hype built up behind it, but now it, it really has zero, honestly. Um, so, I think Infinity Ward, Infinity Ward are my favorite CAD developer. I mean, just look at that beautiful hit detection, man. Look at this gameplay. You can use the worst weapon in the game and do amazing with it. You can't do that in Black Ops 3, okay? You can't use an MR6 and do good. You can't use an L-Car. You can't... You, yeah, man, man, you can't use... It's, it's, it, there's almost no gun balance in Black Ops 3. In, in Infinite Warfare, there's so much gun balance, you have no idea, guys. But, um, enough about that. What am I ranting on about, guys? Uh, Infinity Order are gonna blow DLC 4 out of the water. With zombies, I can already tell you, zombies is gonna be bay. Zombies is more than likely gonna be in space, so outer space, of course. Not like zombies in Spaceland, literally in space, I think, on a different planet, which I'm so hyped to see, dude. That be it's gonna be amazing, dude. I oh my gosh. I might just go out and buy DLC three and DLC four and DLC one and maybe even two for IW just because just for zombies, man. Like the multiplayer maps for DLC 4 I think are going to be pretty cool. For some reason I'm thinking that there's going to be like a lava based one, but I, I don't think so. I don't know, I just came into my mind for a second there and I was just like, what? There might be a lava map? That'd be cool. But, you know, because I think in Black Ops 2, a DLC map, there was like lava. I don't know what it was called, but it was stupid. But it was cool though. It was cool. Um, but uh, I don't know really what else to talk about, man. I'm just really hyped for DLC 4. As you can see, somebody's using the Ryzen right there. Um... By the way, I think they're going to probably add in at least one more weapon drop uh, for IW. Maybe two more, maybe a couple more, I don't know. At least, they're going to at least add one more. They got to do it, dude. They usually add one, like, they usually add two per DLC or something. You know, that's that's probably, that's usually what, they're, what they do. Um, there's nowhere near as many DLC weapons in IW as, uh, as BO3. But, um, that's a good thing. That's a really good thing. But, uh, guys, that, I think, is gonna be it for the video, actually. I just wanted to discuss this. Um, maybe get you, get, maybe get you a little bit more hyped up for DLC 4, dude. It is literally right around the corner. Literally right around the corner. It's, like, three weeks away or something like that. Less than a month, probably. Because usually, usually DLC 4 comes out in September. So, I'm gonna be absolutely hyped 
I'm going to be watching a lot of videos on it, and hopefully I can get the DLC. If not, then I'm still going to be really happy for it. So, guys, thank you so much for watching and tuning into the channel. I've been Omaji Squid. I'll catch you all in the next one. Leave a like if you did enjoy it, and uh, subscribe today and join the Squid Army if you're new for daily videos on this channel and on Blue. Also, guys, and peace out.